everybody. Welcome back to Diamond Art Joy. This is Donna and hey, this is my last Timu haul haul video. <laughs> uh, I guess you want to say hi to Timu the emu. Probably missed him in the last two videos. I think he went on vacation. Anyway, today is something totally different. I've been watching uh, some of the fellow YouTube um, folks with the diamond painting, also doing stuff like resin, using resin molds to make trays and bowls and that sort of thing. And it, it has always interested me. So I thought that I would try it too. And since Timu is a great place to get things, maybe like beginner things, I got some molds to try start with this one here. This one's just like a little bowl. It's got the, the sides here. So you pour the resin down in here along with your glitter or whatever and I'll show you stuff here in a minute with that. But um, I did watch um, Lexi Sparkle Crafts. Lexi's so sweet. I mean, she's the one that makes the, the pretty trays and the bowls and stuff and she sells them and I have several of hers as well you know she puts all those nice little sparklies in there and pearls and everything and you know you can really do just about anything you want and make it whatever color too so this is the mold for that you can use it as like I guess a drill trash tray or I mean not tray but a bowl you know something like that and then here is a mold for uh, a flower. So you just pour it down in here and, um, you know, let it get hard and everything and take it out. And these things just, I think, just use that as support for the actual pouring and, and curing of the actual bowls. I don't think they don't really play a part in the actual little little tray bowl thing itself, but having the flower shape is pretty. You can even see the, the stamens there. And that'll come through too because there's indentations for that. Cute. And same thing, I have a, a shell tray here, little shell tray. Very pretty. You can, you know, I don't know, put your putties in here or, you know, any number of things. You know, a girl can never have enough little bowls and little trays and that thing, you know, that sort of thing, right girls? At least I can't. You always got stuff to put in them. Star shaped. <laughs> so cute. Just thinking you can put, you know, color up whatever color you want to make, like a pink one or whatever, and put a little glitter and <clears throat> whatever you want in there. You know, it just is unlimited whatever your creativity draws you to do. So you would just pour it down in here to the mold and add your goodies. Sounds, sounds easy, but you know it's going to take some practice. And, and Lexi did make a nice video where she showed us how she made some of her things. Thank you, Lexi. I appreciated that. I did watch that. And also, I think uh, Pencil Surprises, she does a lot of resin as well. So this one is just a larger mold for a bigger shell. This would be the bottom. I guess this would be the top, and you could just make like a little dish out of it. You could put jewelry or whatever in there. Just think that would be so pretty with all these sparkles. I've seen this one here, I think, on Instagram, and I can't remember the name of the the uh, Instagram site, but this would be 
the bottom of a dish and it's got these you know sides here three little bulges on each side and then this is would be the top of the uh, actual dish and it would go like that I don't know it, I just the, <laughs> I watched that video and it just mesmerizes me you know they make it look so easy and it's just gorgeous you know the shine and all the little goodies that they put in there to make it really pretty and then this here is um, Disney little uh, Mickey Mouse we've got some of the little things here on the side there's a tiny Mickey Mouse head uh, what is that I don't know looks like a Teletubby head I don't know heart some kind of star oh there's uh, I guess Maleficent's um, horns there and then here's a, a crown and then of course the big Mickey here cute and then a similar one that's got the castle and a dog hair nice <laughs> uh, moons and stars and then there's the castle isn't it cute um, that's from the Timu. Now I'm going to go into something else since I'm doing the resin thing here, but, um, these ones I think I got at Hobby Lobby or Michael's. They're just the plain heart box shape. Oh, and here's, here's a tray. I'm not going to open it, but this is a tray. I think it's similar to Lexi's. Let me have one over here it's got stuff in it but Lexi made this one from Lexi sparkles so pretty she puts feet on hers too which is nice love it see how little she puts her little glitter and everything in there I think this tray is it's a similar version of that and here are my goodies. Look, I got some um, some glittery tinsel looking things that can go down into the resin, make it shine. Gosh, guys, there's so much to choose from out there. I've got some pearls to stick down in the trays too. I saw her do a mermaid tray as well that looked really pretty. I mean, you could put anything in there, I suppose. Here's some more purple beads. More glitter. This one's an iridescent. Cool. Uh, these are little, look like diamonds. <laughs> some kind of gem shaped plastic. And it's got some iridescence on it. Some more glitter, multicolor. Here's some gold, gold flake. I think this is going to be exciting. And some more. I mean, gosh, you know, they just have rows and rows of, of stuff at the, the craft stores that, you know, you can choose from. So I, you know, got to start somewhere. So. I will uh, come back and show you some things that I've made and probably the mess ups too. So <laughs> uh, I'm not sure when I'm going to start it, but uh, soon I think. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. Thanks so much for stopping by again. And this is the last of the team at all. You guys are probably glad I drew, I drew it out too long, didn't I? But maybe uh, next time. I won't get such a big haul. Um, it's fun to watch everybody's. I mean, you never know what you're going to see, right? That's part of the excitement and the, the crinkle of the bags and all that. It's just part of the process and it's enjoyable. So uh, you guys take care. Have a great rest of the summer and I'll be seeing you again soon, y'all. Bye-bye.